Hello friends, welcome to LMS Solution Research Support. So whenever when we are working with an AI tool, the important thing we do need to remember is that prompt. So all the chatbot need prompt. So if you have an idea about prompt, so it will be very useful for you to give a perfect prompt to obtain better results out of that chatbot. So let us go on to today's video and explore a prompt database where it has different types of prompts for all the chatbots as like you for starting from chat GPT, cloud, llama, so all the versions. So it is having different types of prompts. So let us go on to today's video and explore that prompt database. The AI tool what we are going to sorry the tool what we are going to discuss today is that prompt index. So here you will be having an AI prompt database. So the resource for AI prompt and prompt engineering. So here you can see AI prompt database for full of the prompts for ChatGPT, Google Bard, Cloud Tool, Llama, Midjourney, Dali, and Stable Diffusion. So here you will be having all the types of prompts prompts in that. So I am going to click explore AI prompts. So in this you will be having different types of categories so starting from all act as misc business education fun personal marketing a image coding etc so it is a prompt database you can select any of the prompt uh, it will give how the prompt will be for example as far as we are focusing on our academic writing and research paper writing so i am going to give education so in this education uh, you will be having different types of categories here you can see the different types of categories so in this you can see learn OS, lesson planning, explainer, teacher support, uh, interactive lecture, diagnostic quiz generator, parent email learning accelerator, essay and article breakdown, essay improver, research paper summary, gra grammar corrector, breakdown, outline any topic, a paper polisher, so advanced keyboard mastery, uh, a sources, so here you can see explain uh, GPT ultimate research proposal, explore tourism sector, essay thesis, teacher GPT, next uh, aristotic tutoring, selective translation, text il illustration. So like that next uh, you are next page. So in this you, you will be having academic essay, generate education uh, content for a classroom, uh, learn GPT, learn anything now. So these are the different uh, topics available here. So in this you can select any of the uh, database to get prompt for example so i am going to select a research proposal so click on research proposal so in this research proposal you will get the prompt here so i want you to act as a research proposal writer i will provide you with a general uh, research topic and you will need to write a proposal outlining the specific focus of the research the research questions that will be uh, addressed uh, and the methods that will be used to conduct the research. The proposal should also include literature review which summarizes the existing research on the topic and demonstrates the importance and relevance of the proposed study. The proposal should be well written and should clearly convey the value and potential contributions of the proposed research. So this is the prompt about this research proposal. So uh, I am going to copy this prompt and we will check it out with uh, chat GPT. So go to chat GPT so after that so you can copy and paste the prompt so I want to act as a research proposal writer I will provide you a general research topic in this I am going to give on grid connected PV system for electric vehicle charging station so this is the topic i am going to give so just i have copy and pasted the prompt alone so after that uh, so i have given a topic so for that research proposal so let us see how this will how the prompt will works out and it will generate content in chat gpt so just click on that prompt yes our content has started to generate it. so here you can see the title advancing sustainable sustainable mobility grid connected pv system for ev charging station here as i have asked in prompt it has generated the introduction and you can see the literature review so in literature review in, uh, that is key points in literature review include environmental impact technology uh, challenges economic viability uh, next you can see the research question so uh, to address the gap gap identified in the literature the proposed 
research will focus on following key questions that is these are the three key questions next how to solve so what are the different methodologies to solve that particular research question and then you can have the significance of the study so like that it will generate a detailed proposal uh, for that particular prompt so let us explore the same with uh, google board so i am going to copy the same prompt again so go to google board so in this uh, as you uh, many of you know that google board is updated by gemini pro so let us see how it will work out whether it will generate a better content or not so let us see so i have just given the same thing here so here you can see again the content is started to generate introduction research focus and then research questions you can see the literature review too with the proper citations you can see the citations also uh one and two next you can see the research uh, research methodology and then expected outcomes and contributions for that particular statements then then you will be having references and additional notes so yes this will be a better solution as google bot given a better structure for that research proposal so like that you can use the same prompt in cloud and llama also so make use of this option uh, to get a better output uh, from any of the chatbot you are going to use so moving on to our uh, that prompt so like that research proposal so you will be having different types of prompts for example research paper summary so click on the research paper summary so i want you to act as a research paper summarizer i will provide you a research paper on a specific topic and you will create a summary of main points findings of the paper your summary should concise clear accurately objectively communicate the key points of the paper you should not include personal opinions and interpretations in your summary but rather focus on objectively presenting the information from the paper your summary should be written in your own words and should not include any direct quotes from the paper please ensure that your summary is clear concise and accurately reflects the content of the original paper so like that uh, research paper so in order to summarize the research paper so here i am going to copy uh, that prompt so i am going to do the same using chat gpt and bard first we will use chat gpt so i will provide you a research paper on a specific topic so you can mention the topic specific topic on i am going to give the topic as uh, machine learning algorithms for maximum powerpoint tracking in pv system so this is the uh, title i have given machine learning algorithms for the maximum powerpoint tracking in pv system after that you can click enter so let us see how this chat gpt will generate content so here you can see the content has started to generate it so here summary of the uh, research paper on machine learning algorithm for maximum powerpoint tracking in pv system so here you can see the introduction and the key finding and also you can get a summary a summary of that particular paper so this is how uh, chat gpt has generated the content so let us explore the same prompt with the google bot so here you can see copy that content go to board and then and click enter so let us see how this google bot generate answer for the particular uh, question so here uh, it will be, it is asking for not only title it is asking to provide the title authors of the paper you you have liked me summarize i will do my best to create a concise and objective summary for you for you so like that it is asking the author uh, of the paper and detail so you cannot get the uh, so you cannot give the random topic so you have to mention the author title and author uh, thereby it will generate a better content for you so it will be a, a good question asked by board itself because uh, so instead of generating a random content so you can uh, go to any of the search engine and you can get a perfect title that is published paper title and also the author's name so thereby it will Uh, create a better content uh, to summarize that particular paper so like that you can make use of this prompt database so here for example i have uh, shown the two important uh, prompt related to research proposal so apart from this you will be having uh, many number of prompts here so here you can see uh, in education alone this is there are many categories are available so like that you can make use of this option so here you can see for for learn for lesson planning you will be having Uh, this this kind of prompt so after that 
for interactive lecture so you will be having this kind of prompt so like that there are many prompts are available in every section of this prompt database so apart from this you can have other options also so here click act as so here you can see act as a applied expert system act as a javascript console act as a linux uh, terminal act as a board uh, buddy act as a english translator and improver so in order to improve your research paper content you can use this kind of prompt so just click on so i, you, I want to act as english translator spelling character and improver i will speak to you in any language you will direct the language and translate in answer and it get corrected in improved version of my text in English. So like that, it act as a, a English character. After then, you can see prompt optimizer, act, act as an Excel sheet, act as a travel guide, act as a plagiarism checker. Next, act as an advi advisor, act as a prompt analyzer. So for every act as, you will be having a code that is a prompt. So you can use that prompt. So after all, from this, you will be having personal prompts also. So and then marketing prompts. So like that, there are many prompts of available. So as far as education is concerned, you will be having different types of prompts. So you can make use of this prompt to uh, get better content out of any of the chatbot. As I have said, you, uh, as I have said, you can use this uh, prompt in any of the chatbot uh, like uh, ChatGPT, Google Bot, Llama, etc., etc. So wherever you want, you can use. So this will give you a better uh, content for your research paper. So make use of this prompt database to uh, to make your research paper writing easy. So and you can get the bet better content out of any of the databases. Hope this video will be very helpful for you. Thank you for watching this video. Have a nice day. Thank you.